So we're going now, we're going back to the Netherlands. Uh, we've got Eric Bokestan to talk to us. Eric um, referred to himself today on Twitter as a library pirate, which I really liked. Um, but he is also senior advisor at the National Library of the Netherlands. He's a musician and an author and one of the library world's movers and shakers. So Eric, you're going to read your poem, Crashing on the Edge, I believe, which you wrote for your band, Huntsman Apology. Yep. Yes, so, correct. Over to you. Thank you so much, Jane, and, and thanks to, to, to Jasper and Michael, my, my dear friends, and the rest of the whole team for organizing this. I feel humble among this, this great group of speakers, and I'm already truly inspired by, by everyone and everything that I hear. Uh, I could talk hours for, about libraries and, and being neutral or not, uh, but tonight, this evening, um, I'm going to read a poem, because besides being... Uh, a global traveler in search of better libraries. I'm, I'm, I write children's books and I'm a singer in a band. Uh, one of the slides that you see behind me that I wanted to show uh, as we talk about what matters now is, is from my beloved story house in Chester, uh, a library that I helped to create. Slide a little bit. And um, what you see on the back of the wall is I am not defined by my scars, but by my incredible ability to heal. And this is taken in Children's Hospital Week in the UK, and they bring all the children for a week into this, the library. It's a theater, a library, and a cinema. And they, they celebrate these children's stories. And, and I think this saying also goes for our world today. So I think that that's, they change all the lyrics around the walls every, every now and then, and, and they're all beautiful always. So um, back to the poem. The poem that I, that I want to share with you um, is one of hope which most of my poems are not. Uh, but this is called Crashing on the Edge. Paradise seems so small now, and it's getting smaller still. Soon we'll have to wear our sins and hide our shame. The lambs have been butchered. The crosses are burned. This time the smoke will not reach heaven. It will not reach heaven. And you, you talk about love and the things we're fighting for, the way to go and what you want me to reach for. But I remember walking on those empty shores, waves crashing on the edge of the world. In words, there was music. In silence, understanding. In need, there was no suffering. And in love, there was no depending. That's where I will find you again, on the edge, on the edge of the world. Thank you so much. <laughs> 